Hello guys, Blueface gives his side of the story of what went down between his boo slash artist Chrissy and Rock, where WAC 100 contacted authorities to get her put out of the rapper's house. Y'all keep, y'all want my t part of the story on this Christian shit? It's, it's not that deep. I mean, I don't know what y'all think I did to the girl. Um, when all of this was occurring, I was at home and my bed. I was out the night before. My phone was dead. So no, I'm sure people was trying to call me, but it wasn't getting through to me. My being woke me up like, hey, look at the phone. Christian's on live with the police at your house. And I'm like, what? Okay, this is weird. Because I told Krishan it's, it's, it's done with. Like, she she was getting a little too out of hand for me. And it was not, it wasn't, you feel me? Her work ethic wasn't there enough for me to cope with her crazy life. Cope with her crazy life decisions and the way she think and act and move. Um, so, I've been shooting BGC at the at the house. She was never not staying here the whole time. We've been doing this for like damn near a month. She's been not living at this location. I had her put up in another location. She kept trying to come and do weird shit at the BGC. Like she'll come over here and jump in the pool. And I'd be like, yo, stop you messing with the business. Don't do not do that. Like just stay right here where I got you. Then she came back and fought one of the girls and I'm like, yo, why you keep trying to like mix, fuck up the BGC business? I'm filming right now. Like, just stay where I got you. So I sent her back over there. She busted out all the windows and whatnot and had the police over there. And, you know, so yeah, then when she, she made the little spot I had her right hot, I'm like, yo, you getting a little too eye to eye. Like, let's kick back and like, let's not do the do the sis no more, you getting too out of hand. So I had told her like, yo, like me and you, your business relationship is like not, it's, it's done with. Um, So then at the end of BGC, I had the camera people here. I don't think she knew the camera people was here, but she, I don't know, she just came and broke in and it might've all went smooth for her if the camera people wasn't here, maybe, I don't know. Camera people wasn't here. She probably would have just been in this motherfucker. <laughs> but the camera people was here, so she locked herself in the bathroom. The camera people was the ones talking to her. I wasn't here. I don't know why. She, yeah. yeah. So um, what was I saying? Oh yeah. So I don't know why people on live with her talking about I'm the big bad wolf or something banging at the door like I'm trying to get to her. I'm not even in the building. So whoever, well, forget those people. That's neither here nor there. Um, but yeah, so back to the beginning of the story where I wake up to her on live and the police are already here. Well, I got here before me, so he's already talking to the police about like trying to get her out, but they, they want to talk to the owner of the house. I guess they're not going for his word. So that's when I pull up. And I got to play peacemaker and, you know, get the shit, you know, handled like gentlemen. That's all I did. I just pulled up, made the situation smoother than where it was going. Y'all, I don't know why y'all got this shit. We didn't call no police on her. Her sister was, I guess, on live with her. I guess that was one of the people on live with her in the bathroom, thinking I'm outside the bathroom <laughs> for some reason. So that's who called the police. Um... You know, we don't do no polices over here. You know, I ain't. They asked me, do you want us to take her to jail for trespassing? I'm like, nah, I ain't condoning nobody going to jail. So then that's when Wack got super frustrated. So the police like, you want us to take her to jail for trespassing? I'm like, nah, I ain't sending nobody to jail. So then they left, and they left her here. <laughs> and Wack just blew it. Like, he just like, bro, are you serious? They just... So that's when he got fired up. He was not doing nothing wrong. He wasn't doing nothing but, you know, I'm his, I'm he my manager, I'm his artist, so he just trying to, you know, manage the situation. But you know, ain't nobody put no hands on her or touched her or nothing. He was just, you know, frustrated. He was probably really trying to scare her. 
I'll probably say more or less. He never struck at her or got too close to her. You know, I ain't, I ain't letting none of that type of stuff go down. So just a bunch of emotions. Like I said, she she wasn't supposed to be here at the time that she was here. So, you know. Thanks for watching. For more videos, leave a like and subscribe.